just woke up. I am going to go on a walk with my mom this morning and go to Pilates for one of my last times before going up for the wedding. And I'm going to go make a coffee downstairs and I have a new coffee maker that I have yet to show the vlog and I'm so excited. I think it's only fitting I wear a white Pilates outfit because I'm closing down my bride era. One week left of being a bride. I'm gonna miss it. Hello. One week away. How are you Ooh, feeling? So excited. Are you gonna go to Lake Tahoe? Okay, we're making some coffee. Here is the beautiful machine. Don't in. You can pick your your drink with a touch screen. So we're gonna make a couple of lattes. Yeah? Sure. You good with that? Town. Oh, you're vlogging. Hello. Yeah, Copper Kings and burgers. Want to go walk past? Uh, let's see. We can't. We have to make food. I know. I, I don't think we get it. Okay. All right, you guys. I've been so bad at vlogging today. I forgot to vlog like Pilates and I went on a couple errands. And then we've just been watching golf the last few hours. Took like a little cat nap. So we're just Operation Lay Low and make some home cooked meals before we leave for Tahoe. Okay, back from the store. We went to the local grocery store just to get some last minute groceries. Um, we do leave on Tuesday and today is Sunday. So we only have two days, honestly like a day and a half left here, but we didn't want to keep eating out all like constantly because we know we'll be eating out in Tahoe and our honeymoon for like a week and a half straight. So we controlled ourselves from getting takeout and decided to make tonight's dinner and tomorrow's meals from home. So I have Pilates one more time tomorrow morning. Um, I'm officially on PTO for three straight weeks, which I'm, I don't even know how to feel because I've never even been off work for that long. So I'm really excited to be like officially, there are no Sunday scaries in sight. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So I have Pilates in the morning and then I have my, my last nail appointment, my wedding nail appointment and manicure pedicure at 11. And then I might run like one or two last minute errands and then we'll just be packing the rest of the day tomorrow because we are leaving bright and early on Tuesday. So stay tuned. I will try to be better at vlogging tomorrow because I was absolutely trash today. Take that one on the chest. Also for anyone that lives in San Diego, La Salsa Chilena is the best roasted garlic medium, is the best salsa in my opinion out there with the white top. This is the logo. You need to get this. This combo with the salsa and the haba chips. So freaking good. <laughs>
just showered. Got a tired girl over there. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm going to go downstairs, make some coffee, some breakfast, and then get to my nail appointment and run some errands. Let's see if we've got enough. I think we've got enough in here for a double shot of the beans. I'm going to make a iced latte. Right. Check that out. Oh my God, it's so good. This new machine that we've gotten, like literally tastes like a coffee shop. Oh my God, it's so strong and like good smelling, tasting. Another thing on the list today, I'm having a ginger shot and a green juice because we are a team keeping the immunity up before the wedding. So without further ado, Heidi, Sophie, wherever you are out there, cheers. That one's actually not that bad. I kind of wish it was more gingery. Like if it's, if it's not burning my esophagus, I don't want it, you know? on the patio <laughs> look how beautiful it is today not a cloud in sight so I'm obviously taking full advantage we have a little rooftop patio and my girls with me I've got some snacks I've got a poppy my hava chips some salsa okay it is packing time all this stuff behind me is going to start being organized and I need to get my suitcase in here and get the process going. You look like a tap dancer. <laughs> Morning. It is 6.48 and we are about to get on the road. Here's my road trip outfit. This is a Lake Tahoe sweatshirt I actually bought on Abercrombie and Fitch. Like right when we booked our venue, I was like, Lake Tahoe. And then my, I got my Viore joggers and my canes with ankle socks. We're clearly going for style on this one <laughs> and not comfort. <laughs> How many days Four. left? Five. Five. Okay. First stop, empanadas and donuts. Henley, hi. <laughs> I had to go to the bathroom earlier than Ross wanted to, so that's unfortunate for him. He 
Ross, fun fact about him, he likes to make a point of like stopping once and once only and like will try to die on that hill. And if I, I like, I feel like I always have to pee. So I'm always the one that's like, we need to stop. Got some snacks. We got Cheez-It Duo, sharp cheddar and Parmesan. Obviously had to get some sour belts. And then I was really, I had some, I exercised some restraint because I didn't get hot Cheetos. So I deserve an award, but we're just waiting for dad. Dad's going to the bathroom now. Interesting. Was this stop for me or him? We'll never know. I'm just loving my, my wedding nails. They're everything. They're everything I wanted. They're subtle. They're sparkly. Oh, love. the essentials. Ross went back into Subway and got me a Diet Coke. <sighs> because I'm passenger princess. Oh, look at those pretty mountains in the background. Under four hours to Minden. I need to space this out. Yeah, don't check it. <laughs> Do you guys like Ross's new glasses? Swaggy? Comment down below. Yes or yes. Blow up the comments. <laughs> Okay, so since we are getting married in Nevada, technically, because we're right on state line, um, we needed to pick up our marriage license in the same county so that we can sign it on the day of our wedding. And so now we're here at Minden County, Douglas County Clerk's Office in world famous Gardnerville, or at least that's what they claim, is that it's world famous. <laughs> This is what it looks like. Very official. Very official building. Got my future husband. Let's go get this license. We're married. We've got our license. We got it. Ready to go? We're married. Almost. Okay. Ross is getting gas right now. So I figured I'd talk to the camera. I feel like I haven't talked to the camera this whole vlog. I've been bopping around, haven't really taken the time to sit down and talk through stuff. We did just pick up our marriage license. It was so smooth. It couldn't have gone smoother. It took probably like 10 minutes max. We had all our documents all ready to go. Everything was like so perfect. We are about an hour from Reno. So we'll get there just in time for dinner, hang out. I'm really excited to be up there. It's so fun. Um, and yeah. How you feeling, babe? Feeling good? No, I'm very happy with how smooth that went. I know. It was uh, all good. Henley got a couple compliments on how cute and good she was. You yeah. know, so those uh, we always take those and run with them. <laughs> We're like, oh, someone else thinks she's the <laughs> cutest? Interesting. <laughs> So we're not crazy. And we met like this like couple that was like, oh, like heard you're getting a marriage license, you know? Like yeah. and we've been married 38 years, like good luck. And it was just like a cute little encounter and that was cute. nice and yeah. Happens to be one of the people who said Henley was cute, so checks out. Can you close the door, babe? Ooh, it smells like farts in here. Big time. I farted. <laughs> That's why I had the door open. How are you feeling though, five days out? Um, feeling excited. I mean, I'm out. Step one is just get to Reno. We're 55 minutes away, so. Almost there. Once we get there, we can start getting settled and the whole weekend will just start. Really, the week will just start once we get there. So, very, very much looking forward to it. What do you think that you are going to shoot at Edgewood? Mm. Or what's your goal, I should say? I mean, if I could beat my PR, I mean, that's what I try and do every time. Yeah. Which is an 83, so if I could shoot an 82 or lower, that'd be awesome. You know what? You know what? 
you're talking shooting. Like my main goal is just to have fun and enjoy the moment. So true. So facts. And that's facts. Like honestly. And then if I if I'm shooting uh, well and 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 hitting the ball well, then that's a cherry on top. If you're shooting well, you're gonna have a great time. If you're shooting bad, you're still gonna have an amazing time. Yeah. So also, just for the record, I feel like I didn't talk about how I feel about it or how I feel leading up. Yeah. How do you feel? I'm feeling very at peace. This is how do you feel, Mrs. Dolly Dwelly? Whoa. Or I guess I should just say Mrs. Not quite Dwelly. Yet. Yeah, that's true. It'll be Mrs. Dwelly. Whoa, that's crazy. Um, I am feeling Jesus. <laughs> cool, calm, and collected. I feel like we we we've really grounded ourselves this week. We remember like what's important in this whole process, and we're not letting things that don't matter get to us, stress us out. We're just looking forward to like being together, celebrating our love and like focusing on our, our amazing relationship and all the amazing people that are flying and traveling all this great distance to Tahoe to have fun with us. So it's just going to be a great weekend. I feel like it's like the calm before the amazing storm and we're just going to have such a good week leading up. Henley, what are you most excited for? She's excited to see Zeke boy. You're excited to see Zeke? Oh. Zeke and get out of this freaking car, mommy. My hands are freezing, but it's a beautiful, crisp day, um, and we're really excited. I just put it all together, it just flowed. He's writing his vows. Just like finishing the, just putting it all together from a bit of jumble to a flowing. <laughs> serious I think I should get a piece of paper or something so I don't get this book dirty on the table 
I got these really cute books on Etsy. They have like the gold foil um, and we got them personalized with our wedding date. So excited. All right, time to transfer them from the phone to the book. Actually, looks like it's gonna be a thunderstorm at some point. It's still really beautiful though. All right, we're about to write them. <laughs> We're gonna have to cover our papers like it's the damn SATs. No. Uh, everyone would cheat off me in school. No looking. <laughs> yeah. Would they? That's a smart kid. Really? No. <laughs> I got this really cute sweatshirt embroidered, and Ross has um, one in black that he has that he's not wearing right now, but it says our wedding date, R plus yeah, D on the sleeve. Like and then it says Dwelly on the front. <laughs> Oh my god, this is gonna take a while Reppin. to write. I haven't written this much in a long time. Oh my gosh! It's the night before we go to Edgewood and have our wedding weekend. And we decided during a thunderstorm watch to come out to the driving range to polish our skills. Ross is playing the Edgewood golf course tomorrow, so... doing one more then we're gonna go up and have dinner and then get an early bedtime so we can wake up bright-eyed and bushy-tailed for tomorrow oh you like the way you look yeah. guarantee you <laughs> oh day one of wedding weekend let's go oh yay oh. we're headed to tahoe in like an hour and it's a beautiful day. I think it's supposed to get sunny in Tahoe too, which is amazing. Um, but we just gave the dogs a little romp. And now we're headed back. Hello, good morning. Um, like I said, today is Edgewood day. Do a little bit of soft glam. I am getting a massage today. We're doing a girl's spa day and the guys are going golfing. Um, so I don't wanna wear too much makeup, but I just wanna look a little cute to show up. So. I'm wearing my matching Dwelly sweat set today, which I'm really excited about. Can't wait to un unveil it. Whoa, whoa. This is the Say Sun Glow. Tried to get a couple of reef, I tried to get a refill at two different Sephora's and it was sold out. So clearly the people have caught on. The people have caught on, but anyway, yeah. Can't believe that it's here like i can't and i can i feel like we've been waiting for so long and the lead up has been so like i don't know just gradual that i am like ready like i'm ready to have this weekend i'm ready to be ross's wife which is crazy to say um i'm just ready to do what we've been planning for so long we are like set to go I'm just gonna do like a little eyebrow gel no, I don't think mascara, maybe curl my eyelashes a little bronzer, a little blush. We'll be good. On our way. I miss Headley already. We're ready to kick it off.
to do a room tour really quick. This is our room for a wedding weekend. High ceilings, so beautiful. It's so spacious, like there's a whole sitting area here. All our stuff's everywhere already, but. And then there's like an extra little seating area. Look at these views. <laughs> oh my God, with a beautiful little like patio. Holy. And then in here is the bathroom. We got a little tub on this side. It literally is like a spa. Headed to night one. Night one. Dinner at the villa. Let's do Gotta it. Gotta eat everything. I think that's all you got on you right now. We're, t we're so talked out right now. See you in the morning. It's wedding day. Retainers and all. Babe, say, say hi. The wedding day. Hi. Are we gonna do a cold dip this morning? I think we are. Cold dip time, cold dip time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a cold dip? Yeah. I know, me too, kind of. It's going to be crazy. Yeah. Beautiful day. We got a little bit of cloud that I think is going to blow off.
tinggal focus Thank you so much. You're welcome. Okay, I am walking to get my hair done. Ross and I just said bye. Next time we see each other, I'll be in my wedding dress. I'm so excited. I'm just ready to go. I'm ready to marry Ross. That is crazy. I will have a husband by the end of today. What? Anyway, I'm going to get ready with the girlies right now and I'm so excited, so. Exhausted. I was in the most best way. Yeah. I think about everything last night and I just can't wait for like our video and like I know. our photos and yeah. How is your breakfast? Very good. Very, very, very good. Very good, very good. Reminiscing <laughs> on the songs that hit on the dance floor the hardest. I need your love. I need your love. I'm gonna go for three jacuzzis or we're gonna get the jacuzzi pose massage. I don't know. I might be jacuzzied out. I know, me too. Ross, show you a ring again. Okay, ready? Post spa. Can you tell I got a facial? That glow though. We're just chilling. We're just petting the honey girl. <laughs> She's tired from a big day of walking down the aisle yesterday. <laughs> 
plans for tonight include um, nothing, nothing, and nothing. And now we're here, like, so chill we, and relaxed, and there's nothing going on. Either. We literally just got married in that room and on that lawn yesterday. Wow. Hi, Henley girl. Hi, sweetheart. Oh, yeah. These are really good. Okay, we're coming back to the scene of the crime. Our ceremony site. 24 hours later, it looks a little different. Oh my gosh. Look at the chills. So, cocktail hour, reception. Huh? I know. We took our beach sunset pictures right down here. So this was like the altar right here. And then bam, beach. What are you doing? We are back in San Diego, as you can see behind me. Gosh, first off, I can't believe my stack. Oh my God. Um, we just got back last night from Tahoe and I just wanted to wrap the wedding video. I don't necessarily think I really sat down to talk to the camera because obviously I was busy. So I just wanted to wrap the wedding vlog and say that it was literally the best weekend of our lives. We just keep like going back and recounting everything that happened and we just can't believe that all the stars aligned. We had the best weather you could ask for. Like it was literally a dream and we're so just overwhelmed. Overwhelmed, first off, with... Gr <laughs> anyway. We are just overwhelmed with like gratitude and can't believe that we got to have such an amazing weekend. It's just like truly insane. And we started getting the pictures. <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> we started getting the pictures back and they are so unbelievable too. So I am a wife, which is like, crazy to say but it feels so good to be married to Ross and it just feels like you know some people told us that you know it would feel different and we already lived together before getting married um we have a dog together we have a house together so we did a lot of the, the steps you know kind of like before getting married that a lot of people do after and so I wasn't sure if it would feel different being married since we've been together so long and have a house and dog and it does feel different. I, it, I just feel more deeply connected to Ross. Um, and it just feels like more like cemented in like the universe. And like, there's something so crazy about like pronouncing your vows and your love, like in front of all your people. That's a very powerful thing too. So it just feels like we're so, so connected. I feel like we're re-entering this like honeymoon phase. Um, perfect for tomorrow. And we're just like so giddy and just like, I don't know, we're just so happy. So um, we're so appreciative of everyone that made the trip out and we're just so lucky. So we're headed to Cabo tomorrow, bright and early. We cannot wait. I'm going to try to do a honeymoon vlog. We'll see how much content I get. Stay tuned for that. But thank you for watching our wedding vlog. And um, it was just the best weekend ever.